hey guys and welcome back to my channel now this was kind of an unexpected video i didn't really expect to be making this video like i just said i assume you know what i'm talking about by the title of this video i'm sorry but i'm not sorry I kind of unexpectedly took a break from YouTube. I say unexpectedly quite a lot. So I need to think of what's another word for unexpected. I not accidentally, well it was kind of an accident. Anyway, I took a break from YouTube. It wasn't planned. I just wanted to kind of do a real honest talk and just explain a bit about where I am at the moment in my life and why I haven't posted really any videos for like one or two months now. I was getting into a really good system of uploading my videos and then it was kind of getting less and less and then eventually it was just no videos and I think you can probably tell that it wasn't great like I was kind of getting really burnt out and just stressed out and I didn't want to put up videos that were like half as good as what I could have produced if I had rested and taken the time. So that's kind of where we're at. What's the date now? It's September. So I think the main thing in my life at the moment has been a really big issue that I'm dealing with, which is I have a terrible toothache. And I know you're thinking, what on earth has this got to do with YouTube and making videos? But trust me, it has stick with me to the end. I originally got a toothache back in I think it was January and it kind of came and then it went probably like just for a week or so and I've had toothache before where it's lasted a couple days and then it goes away and then it never comes back for like a year or so so I just kind of assumed this was one of those times. I haven't been to a dentist probably in about seven years Dentists are a massive phobia of mine. If you know me, you know that I suffer quite badly with anxiety and dentists are definitely up there on my list, almost as high as my fear of spiders, but not quite. So I was really hesitant to go to a dentist. I went to my doctor about it and she referred me to a specialist, which I have actually been to before, like a few years back. So I know the place well. So she sent off a referral and the referral only came back probably like a couple months ago now. So it was quite a long while. My toothache went since then, but within this couple of months, it's kind of resurfaced. And so I was kind of glad that I sorted it out then, even though I was absolutely terrified to suggest it, but I'm glad that I did. And uh, this referral is taking a long time. And I understand that obviously it's, you know, it's, a very popular service and they are a specialist so there's a waiting list and there's a whole procedure but it's just frustrating because this toothache is so painful and I've been taking stuff for it but it's not ideal because it causes it treats the pain not the cause of it so it's kind of just draining me mentally and emotionally and physically just all the ways it can drain you it's been draining me I um, went to my original dentist, for those asking, I was brave enough and actually went to a normal dentist for the first time in seven years, but they couldn't really do much to help me, so it's just a waiting game really, till I get my appointment back. So please pray that that happens soon. But I would say that's probably the main reason why I haven't really been posting. It's really taking a lot of energy out of me. I haven't been sleeping well at all because of the pain. I can't swallow tablets to save my life in case you're wondering. I haven't been sleeping well. It's just been bothering me constantly and I can't stop thinking about it. So it's like I can't really concentrate on a lot of things or find the motivation to do things. And because of it, like it's just draining me. And it's just meant that like I've got so far behind on everything like as you can tell I you know I'm trying to be as real and as honest as I can in my videos I didn't tidy my room because I thought that's not a representation a true representation of what I'm going through at the moment things get on top of me 
I am a very organized person well I try to be I try to be very neat and very tidy and when I'm not like that you can tell that something is wrong and my room is a complete mess and oh, apart from my washing that's supposed to be there but I thought well you know the rest of it's a mess just leave it up there but when things get on top of me and I get stressed and I get overwhelmed then things don't get done and it's frustrating for me because I trip over stuff all the time and I want to get it done but I'm just so tired and exhausted and it's just really really just just affecting me so much and I'm really struggling it's bringing my mood down as well like I'm not enjoying things and it's just really frustrating so yes please pray that an appointment comes through soon so that's probably my main thing I've also I'm getting distracted because there's hairs on my puzzle mat and it's bugging me I've also gone through a lot of change recently and as you will know if you have autism change is very difficult I found out that I may need to be moving again soon and so that's uh, a bit stressful because I only really just moved into this place and got used to it and now I might have to be moving again but hopefully this time I will move and it will be a more permanent place I also have a lot of change going on there's changes happening at my church there's changes happening just in general like I've started swimming lessons which is a big change for me and a, another big phobia of mine so I'm really really challenging my anxiety at the moment which is very tough and again just mentally draining like all of this change is stressing me out and overwhelming me and then of course I get nothing done so I'm just a bit like depleted at the moment and I just don't have the energy to put the time and commitment and and the energy into the videos that I would like to um, which is a shame because I absolutely love making videos and please 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 stick around because next month I'm gonna hopefully be back. I have a lot of vlogs waiting to be edited and put together which you know I'm so excited about but again I'm really behind on them because some of them happened last month and I still haven't got around to editing them and I have still been doing my bullet journaling I just haven't really posted about it but I'm hoping that I'm not I've decided I'm not going to do a video for this month I know I didn't really explain anything last month I didn't even really say like oh I'm not going to do a video I'm sorry I kind of just didn't do anything but I think I think this month I think even though I could get something done like it's just going to stress me out not having as much time as I'd like to do it so I'm just going to probably show you the finished pictures on Instagram that's what I did last time that I didn't get a video out so I'm sorry about that but you know I need to take care of myself first and you're not going to get exciting fun good content if you know I'm not at my best so that's just the deal of it I've also been working on some music which is exciting original and non-original and I'm really excited to hopefully get that out soon as well so there's a lot of stuff to look forward to so you should definitely stick around so yeah not like the most exciting video like basically me saying like how low I've been and like oh like I'm so tired and exhausted but you know it's good to have a rest sometimes and this is your sign that if you are feeling depleted and burnt out and like you're overdoing it it's good to rest and it's important to rest and it is necessary to rest and you shouldn't feel sorry for taking care of yourself and putting yourself first so that is where i'm at you know i am still here <laughs> somehow plodding along just about getting through every day it's all about taking things step by step and not overdoing it you know I might just do a little bit of my room today I might have a nap I might not and go from there don't overwhelm yourself by trying to think of everything you have to do all at once because that really doesn't help and it definitely doesn't help me but I'm hoping that next month I will get back on track so thank you for sticking with me if you made it to the end of this video. I hope you appreciate what I've had to say and I hope that 
you will hang around and look forward to my next videos and yes if you are new and you have no idea who I am then I'm Holly aka Ducky as a lot of my friends call me and you can subscribe and ring the bell to receive notifications every time I upload a new video because like I said a lot more exciting stuff to come so thanks I'll see you when I see you.